Hey there, it's Jenny with Planner Perfect and I'm here for another video um, and I'm going to be sharing with you my Bible study stack. What I'm using, what study I like, and um, all the accessories. For heaven's sakes, stay tuned. Welcome back, you guys. Listen, um, this is a highly requested video and I'm happy to share it. Um, I've had a lot of women ask me, you know, what Bible study are you using currently? Um, and all that kind of good stuff. That's kind of stuff is always great to share as women to women. Just really kind of sharing what, you know, what study are we doing? What are we, what, 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 what are you using for your quiet time? Welcome. My name is Jenny Penton, founder of Planner Perfect, and I coach women how to write a better story for their lives. I'm also a homeschooling mom of eight. And um, I can't wait to share with you and dive in with you on some of the different um, elements that I love to use in the morning when doing my quiet time and studying with God. I have gone through a lot of different ones and I am open to all of them and I use a lot of them. I mean, it's just I've done the Bible app where it tells me which verse I'm on and then what I, I should be reading. So I love doing that. Um, but I wanted something a little bit more in depth that could really take me through. Now, this one kind of hit the market. I do believe it hit it this this last year. And um, I was kind of enamored by how it looked at first. And um, I really, really love it. I really, really do. And it's just, it's like an in-depth from the beginning to the end study. And that's what I really, really love because ultimately you're wanting to know God, the character of God and what really all was going on. You know what I mean? Because I think for me, it can be get, you know, sometimes it can be just so intimidating, especially if you're going through something in your life, you tend to like, you know, anyway, about creation, I need to heal my body right now. You know, I would get like stuck, like, I just want to focus on just this and all that. But then, you know what? I had a new transformation in my mind about that. And God really spoke to me and he said, you know what? This is a journey where you already know that you are. You have already got a healed body. You know, your body is, is on its journey of healing itself. And so it's just like letting the, the stronghold go of feeling like you've got to always be focused on the thing that's wrong and focusing, like, again, I've been saying for a long time and I had to say it to myself, it's time to just love God, focus on God and praise God. Okay. So this is what I've been doing and I really love it. So this is the old Testament and this is the new Testament. This is the new. And so I, in the morning, I, um, go through here. Let me just kind of show you because this is the old Testament. So I do both. So in the morning, each morning, I'll, I'll do a dabble, a couple pages in each. So what I love about it is that he talks about, and it's really, the graphics are amazing. And, um, this is also by Zach Wendall, but it's, it's really, really amazing. And he gives you prefaces, my search for meaning. He talks about it. He gives you the introduction of the different um, um, books of the Bible in the Old Testament. Um, Torah, historical, prophetic, and then wisdom are these different um, books. And I, I just, it's very enlightening. I, I really, really love it. Talks about Genesis, the book. And then I just fill it out and write within these pages. And then anything else that I really want to explore upon, I will grab a notebook and write in that, which as you know, that's another story, but I have a really beautiful notebook that I'm coming out for anything, but would be really great for faith journaling. So anyway, and you just write in this, this is your workbook. This is your study. And so I just absolutely love it. And he talks about creation I mean, you're literally going back to basics when you're in Genesis, you're like, what was done on day one? Read this, and then you're writing it out. So it's like you know, like in school, it's kind of like you're you're studying it, and then you got to write out exactly what happened, so that you were really comprehending and remembering what you read and understanding what you read. You're comprehending it, so it's kind of like that. And then he goes, "There's just these never breaks his promises. God never breaks his promises." That's what it says. 
And so anyway, this has been just really, 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 I'm enjoying this. And this is what I am currently using. I do a lot of different st uh, studies. I like Pris Priscilla Schreier. I love, um, gosh, <clears throat> I love listening to pastors. I mean, I just, I go banana. I love Miles Monroe, um, the late Miles Monroe. Um, my favorite Bible I use the MacArthur Study Bible. I absolutely love it um, because uh, it is a study Bible. So I have actually several Bibles and um, that's for another deal because <coughs> I have different Bibles for different things, which sounds obsessive and weird and quirky, but I do nonetheless, that's for another video. I have several different Bibles because I've got a beautiful, journaling Bible so I can get creative and really write in the lines. And this one is for study and for highlighting. So the MacArthur Bible, obviously, you know, this, it, it's got the um, um, study portion at the bottom. So that's all study. And so, you know, it's just highlighting and scribbling on and really just studying in it. That's what this is. And my journaling one, I really like it to be beautiful. And so I, uh, but this one, this is like, I do believe it's a faux leather. Maybe it's a real leather. But I love that you can just like, you know, like it's like you're studying, okay? And I didn't want a hard bound. I wanted this, this, this leather one. And um, again, on my Amazon, I will link you to it. But it's just, it's my study Bible. I grip it around my armpit and it's with my big mug of coffee and it's my morning like regime, getting to know God with this. I absolutely love it. What accessories do I use with studying in my Bible in the morning with my coffee? Well, of course the Everyday Bag by Planner Perfect. Okay, now this is not in our store yet, but it is going to be released. Um, I don't know of a complete release date, but it's 2021. It's this year. Okay, so this is in our Zsa, Zsa print. Exciting. It matches my nails. You see that? I'm getting ready for fall already. So this is Zsa, Zsa after Zsa, Zsa Gabor, duh, okay? Anyway, this is gonna come in several different leathers, okay? Sure to please everyone. Inside is a beautiful leather, very camel, classy on the inside, you see that? Um, it'll have my brand stamp on the inside. This is just a prototype and doesn't have it but all of them will be stamped with this beautiful uh, stamping, gold foil stamping. And I keep, um, this goes for my planning and even for my Bible. I love sticky notes. If I just want extra room in my study Bible, I'll do a sticky note and I'll just scribble, scribble, or a certain scripture or something like that. Even a little bit of washi, tape something on, and um, I'm good to go with this. So I absolutely love it. And mind you, look at the detail. This little fob is the daisy. And I absolutely love it after my brand. Okay, then this fuzzy delight. Um, I just, is all my highlighters. And I open it up and I'm like, hi, I love it. Now, here's the bad thing. I don't know if Aerie still carries it. And that's where I got it, Aerie, American Eagle, okay? Last Christmas. Um, it's probably not there, but you might want to look, you might want to do a little investigating. You might want to, because this is absolutely the cutest thing on the planet. Now I got this off Etsy. So it's just some <sighs> cutesy thing I got to dangle off my, um, off the zipper. And so I keep all my great highlighters in it. I use the, uh, Mr. Pen highlighter. It's in my Amazon. You want a direct link. They even got skinny ones. This is more of a different one. Stabilo. I think that's how you pronounce it. Anywho, that's all loaded in there and delicious, as you can see. That is my planner stack. That is what I use. Not my planner stack. That's my Bible stack. Okay. And that is what I use for me and Jesus in the morning with my coffee. I hope you liked it. Thank <laughs> you.